The day is March 27th, 2021, and I had a random idea for a stream. I had around a thousand subscribers at the time, and a fun idea I had would be a public forum that anyone could join. After attempting it for around half an hour, my computer had blue screen twice and half the people could not even join. We peaked at around 20 players. Attempt number one, fail. April 23rd, 2021. Attempt number two. It was much more successful. We had a lot more people show up, so we could have a higher maximum player count in theory, and we managed to complete the mines in a single day, and reached over 50 players joined at one time. November 20th, attempt three. I'm gonna be telling you the story of this attempt and how we managed to break an insane world record with over 100 Stardew Valley players in a single farm. Before the stream had even started, I knew I was in trouble. I'd scheduled the stream in advance by about four hours, and two hours before it, I already had over 100 people waiting. This was more viewers than the rest of the streams I'd done with the public farm when the stream was actually going. So I was kind of panicking a little bit. I was basically just running around the farm, panic building cabins, and I assumed I would have more than enough cabins, but I was actually wrong in the end. When the clock struck one and I was ready to start the stream, I had almost 300 people waiting for me to start. It was probably the most stressed I've ever been to start the stream. Well, probably second most stressed. The Starter Valley Cup was way worse, but it was very nerve wracking. And part of this was, I knew that it was gonna be very tough to get this many people on the farm. But you know what's not super hard? Checking out today's sponsor, NordVPN. NordVPN is a VPN that protects you online and gives you a ton of killer features. And if you use the link in my description and the pinned comment, you can get 70% off of a two year plan and one free month. Some of the features that I like best is that it's super easy to use, requiring just one click to enable it, or you can even enable it automatically when you start up your computer. You can choose from over 5,000 servers in 60 different countries, and it even works on basically every single major platform, like Mac OS, Linus, sorry, Linux, Windows, Android, iOS, and even your Android Smart TV. Can't buy a game in your country? Easy, just switch to that country using NordVPN and buy it there. You can also unblock region-restricted content using it quickly and easily. We'll also protect against DDoS attacks in case Dark Valley gets a little bit too intense for your liking. Once again, use my link in the description to get 70% off a two-year plan and one month free. That's nordvpn.com slash wallygug. So I had already done two of these before, and I would only managed to get 50 players, and my goal was 100, so 100 is double 50. And if I struggled to get 50 on and was basically unplayable then, how the heck am I supposed to get on now? And most of the time, it won't even let you join, like it physically won't let you join. So I was extremely worried, it was just not gonna pan out, and I was gonna get like 10 people in, and the stream would be a complete and utter bust. That's kind of what it was looking like at first, but we had a really big turnaround. So I started stream, I just kind of sat there for a little bit chatting, telling people what was going to happen and kind of just waiting for people to come in and notice that the stream was actually live. I pinged my discord, etc. I made a community post and by this time, people were joining my discord fast because I said that the code was going to be released inside of my discord only. So people were joining my discord and they were joining it insanely fast. We went from 1200 members to 1600 members in the course of one day. It was absolutely incredible and I was completely and utterly panicking. So I released the code to my channel members first and one guy joined, everything looked like it was cool. And then, and then I released it to the public. So I assume hundreds of people were trying to join at one time because we had around 500 viewers at that point. People were spam joining and maybe 10 people got in before no one else could get in. Like there was like a solid minute where no one else was getting in. So I had a few other ideas. Basically, first thing I tried was I restarted my game without mods because I had actually had mods on to help me build the cabins because I didn't want to manually start up a farm, grind all the wood and then build the cabins by hand because that's just stupid and a waste of my time. So I'd launch with mods. So I turned off the mods, launched again. This time around 15 people got in. I don't really think the turning off mods really affected anything. I think it was just luck. And at this point, I, I just knew, oh my God, I'm so dead, I'm so dead, right? But I'd come up with an idea where I was gonna try to stagger the entry, but it just was not working at all. And people were still trying to spam join, so it just did not work. <laughs> So at this point, I knew, okay, well, the stream's a bust. I'm completely dead, right? No, I actually went and downloaded an unlimited players mod, which shouldn't have done anything, but it did do something apparently because I had done a few other restarts, stuff like that to see if anything else would work. Nothing was working. I was on my fourth restart. <laughs> People were kind of getting sick of it, <laughs> but I launched with this and it didn't work. Well, game over. Well, guess I'm not doing the stream. Then I remembered I didn't change the config. So I changed the config to around 150 players because I didn't know how many cabins I had. I assumed I had less than 150 though. Then I relaunched the game with that and it started working. <laughs> players began spam joining and my game instantly became completely unplayable. 
Yeah, drop drop an L in the chat. Drop drop an L in the chat for real. Jesus Christ, that is so many L's. Uh, <laughs> you know what? Let, let's live on the edge a little bit. Let's turn off the slow mode. Let, let's turn off slow mode. No slow mode. Is it working? Oh my god, it's so laggy. <laughs> it's so laggy. Um, um, <laughs> uh. I can hear my CPU fans heating up. <laughs> oh. My- oh my god, my screen's black. No, I'm stupid, you're right. How many people do we have in? How many people do we have in? Now playing, who asked? Featuring no one. <laughs> Guys, my game is completely frozen. Okay, I beg you, someone who is in right now, sleep in the bed and tell me how many people are in the game. So at this point, way more people than we had before were joining at once. Like it was basically a solid chat menu of people joining, which was absolutely amazing. So I knew now it was just a matter of time before we eventually hit the 100 players because I just figured like it wouldn't let this many people join. It wasn't just gonna randomly stop. It was either kind of all or nothing. So I assumed we were kind of in the clear and we just needed to wait now. And I was right. We slowly started climbing. We hit 50, 70, 80, and finally 100. I was actually trapped in the mine, so I couldn't see me hit 100 in live time, but someone sent a screenshot and oh my god, it was glorious. Triple digit Stardew Valley players in a single farm. Now, here's my live reaction when we hit it. Oh my god, a hundred, what? We smashed the record, no way. We just doubled the record, guys, and we're still going. We're still going, let's go. So I was obviously pretty stoked about this considering I just smashed the world record. So here, look at this funny screenshot of what it looks like on the map with this many people in the game. And by the way, the game was obviously completely unplayable. I'd initially like thought, oh yeah, we should go see if we can complete the mines like this. It was genuinely unplayable. I was getting 0 0.5 frames per second. I was counting. I was individually counting the frames. That's how laggy it was. But it's still a super cool experience. Thank you to everyone who came out and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys later. One player in equals 1,000 subscriber. Please subscribe.